Miss Britney Spears exploded on the scene in December of 1998 with the breakout hit, Hit Me Baby, One More Time. As a fresh faced 18 year old, Miss Spears may have appealed to a small number of young girls with her cute outfits and blonde locks, but hardly made a blip on the radar of the worldwide music scene. Britney's anonymity would not last long. On February 9th, 1999, Britney appeared on the Rosie O'Donnell Show, possibly the last talk show appearance of that little innocent girl from backwoods to Louisiana. For it was just three months later that the world would take notice. The date, May 18th, 1999. The place, Nickelodeon's Kids' Choice Awards. It was a rainy evening and Miss Britney Spears walked onto a slippery stage to perform her booby-shaking hit, Hit me, baby, one more time. For pubescent boys and men alike, it was an evening that won't soon be forgotten. I ask you now, faithful viewers, to come with me on a journey. A journey of fear, enlightenment, and chronic masturbation. As we explore the mystery that is Britney Spears' breasts. Britney was obviously enjoying her new grown-up look as she posed for the men's magazine, FHM. Her breasts seemed to be maintaining their rather large and bulbous look as she performed in the L.A. concert Wango Tango in the summer of 99. It wasn't long after this that Britney popped up on French TV with gazongas that even made Anna Nicole Smith jealous. As one might imagine, the boobs took a back seat in 2000. The world was a new place. Britney turned 19 and the new Queen of Pop released her second album. The focus was the music and what harmonious sounds they were. But Britney's sweater mittens would not be denied the spotlight for long. For it was just 30 days into 2001 that Britney took the stage of the Super Bowl. Once again showing the power and glory that is her fabulous rack. Brace yourself, viewer, for what I'm about to show you will shock you and possibly affect the very fabric of your being for the rest of your life. The time, February 2001, a mere one month after the Super Bowl. The place, the set of Britney Spears' new movie. These are actual video captures of two scenes from that movie. Behold! Be amazed, be confused, and draw your own conclusions. I know this is difficult, but I must continue. Just a mere two months ago, in October 2001, Britney appeared on HBO in a live concert from Vegas where the magnificence of her milkers took center stage. Look closely and study hard for the final shocking evidence is about to be revealed. In November of 2001, Britney appeared on a television interview. Once again, I stress that these are unaltered images. Let there be no mistake, you are seeing correctly, possibly the most mind-bending evidence to date. I leave you now with one final photo, appearing this month on Rolling Stone magazine. Remember, the truth is out there. Look, listen, and draw your own conclusions. Perhaps one day we will all know the truth that is Britney Spears' breasts.